Bonjour mon ami. I've had an urge to put on really intense face paint makeup and in the effort of perhaps normalizing extreme, not body shape morphing, but like just avant-garde body performance. So tomorrow I'm driving down to LA to visit Liv, who if you watch this channel, you know very well, she does the intro and outro, which will be happening right now. So I'm gonna be wearing crazy makeup and face paint um, for my entire stay in LA. Um, and yeah, cue tomorrow. All right, see you then. Alrighty. So today's the big day. It is the morning. I actually have zero idea what time it is. Um, and today the psycho look that I am going to try and emulate is this image. It is in the, what I consider to be an excellent film <laughs> called Once Upon a Time in Mexico, directed by Robert Rodriguez. Johnny Depp plays like a, you know, corrupt CIA, I think CIA, just like American government official um, who basically gets his eyes poked out by the daughter of a, oh, this shit is not working. Okay, he gets his eyes poked out by the daughter of a drug dealer. Um, anyway, the movie is a little, I wouldn't say it's like the most politically sound film I've ever seen in terms of casting, but also literally who am I to say anything about that? I, I'm not Robert Rodriguez. And I have nothing but love for his work. Okay, now now that I modified the disco ball, time to even this shit out. Um, I don't use a lot of makeup or like face products. Like this is the fullest beach you're gonna get. Nice glossier tinted moisturizer from probably 2018. <laughs> Brown pencil. It's like the label is. It's from. Oh god. It's from, oh, it's from 100% Pure. It's from that place where um, everything's made out of fruit, I think. This is made out of cacao or something like that. By the way, where I'm going, I'm going to visit a friend in Highland Park area. I've actually never been to Highland Park. I'm actually like hugely under schooled about LA. Okay, that looks strange. <laughs> well, that's okay. So let's do lips first because, because no, no, no reason. Oh, do you hear how dry my lip is? Do you hear that? I hope you heard that. So the main reason I'm going down stairs to Southern California is because I ordered some roller skates. They're like, well, they're, they're, I actually got them in October for a birthday present for myself, but, um, they were from the 70s. They're like pop-out roller wheel skates from the 70s. And I took them once on the East River to like have a nice morning skating. And they just broke, the wheels just shattered. So there's like a custom roller skate shop to get your shit fixed and that's what I did. So now I'm gonna pick them up. Am I insane, do you think? Like, so this looks terrible, but that's fine. Don't worry. <laughs> okay, well. I'm much more satisfied now with this. I'm looking in the mirror, it looks fucking bomb, honestly. So I'm gonna use a lip liner to make the drops. Ugh, do I need to sharpen this? Oh, what? <laughs> okay. Um. I think the main thing that I need to do while doing this experiment is just dive deeply into the whatever mindset. Life is a deeply elaborate performance, so why not treat it like what it is? Okay, um, palette, eyeshadow. Okay, I'm taking 
like this is just an eyeshadow palette from like this is like the naked one palette from middle school for me so i'm just gonna take i think this is an anastasia one i'm not entirely sure what it is all right then so now i'm gonna kind of dematify it with lip gloss this is my favorite lip gloss it's gypsy by Ilya. first onto the lips because everyone knows the most important investment during covid is lip gloss so that your mask knows you're not fucking around oh god this is such a mess sorry the lighting is so chaotic kind of makes my eyes look shiny dead energy known for but oh god see i messed this shit up do you see that is that the look <laughs> we need sunglasses the drops don't really come below my sunglasses is that enough <laughs> i'm like is this too is this enough <laughs> is this enough <gasps> i guess not and I'm just actually gonna not wear mascara because I don't want to. Okay, see you on the road. Oh my god, I'm going, I can't do this at the same time. All right, just finished getting gas and they have like pop music blasting out of the fill up pumps. I look psycho right now. Arrived in the city of angels looking like an absolute demon. <laughs> I've just been staying grounded. I'm so <laughs> glad. Like, like whatever I want. That's so I don't cool. I have like no idea what I want. Do you want it's actually a good idea to get a set. It'd be really great to get a matching set and it say like potatoes soil or something that <laughs> Good morning all from Highland Park, Los Angeles. It is a beautiful February day. Basically, I'm gonna do a little bit of work this morning and then um, beat my face like a maniac <laughs> for the afternoon. Okay, I'm working outside today, guys. Lip pencil, lip pencil, lip pencil, red, red. I'm giving clown. I didn't realize that I'd be giving clown. But here we are giving clown. I guess that's very clown. Y'all can't see anything either. I might go inside with this. You know, I think this is today's beat. Giving very much clown. I'm gonna go clean it up. Yeah. Old Land Zyme shot. You recognize 
the shot. Okay, so the power is gone. We have nothing to any of our names. Just kidding. But I did an outfit change. I still look like a maniac. But um, I think we're all gonna go out for some outdoor dining. And honestly, if I change my makeup, it truly depends on how much water is purchased. But that might change. Anyway, buckle up. <laughs> When I look at the video, it's upside down. Just <laughs> Certainly wasn't at all the. The other one, but I didn't get to it Making eye contact with my camcorder right now. Whoa, the fire looks out of control on this camera. <laughs> Good morning from day three of what initially started as a makeup challenge and is now, I guess, a survival challenge. Um, just having some coffee on a 41 degree freezing California winter. Yesterday we went to these hot springs um, and they're like a walk right over this way, over yonder. Um, and they were nude hot springs and there were all kinds of lovely people there and the water was warm um, and it was straight out of a dream. at home um i'm gonna shower eat some dinner and probably fall asleep immediately but tomorrow i will be waking up setting up the camera like a non-chaotic desert rat and doing the final look why 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 hello hello i'm back from the adventure Sorry if this angle is weird. My camera's freaking out. Um, I had a bad day with it. It fell onto a sidewalk. <laughs> and now, now I, it won't for some reason. It won't behave. Today I'm doing the final look. I am back in the bay. I've got my stuff all here organized. Where are you? Where are you? He doesn't want to say hi. Oh, there you are. Say hi. Um, and I'm doing what I believe to be maybe the best makeup look I've ever seen. Inspired by an incredible Instagrammer named Lucifer. Um, I'll insert the picture on top of this. Or it could just focus. Anyway, it's incredible. 
and I'm gonna do my very, very best to recreate it. Um, I've never done a look like this, and I'm using the same white pencil that you saw me psychotically apply in the middle of the hot springs, which is a beautiful story that I'll get into because I realized I kind of faded away into some sleep deprived magical state of mind instead of talking to y'all all the time. Okay, first things first. Okay, now I am using the Charlotte Tilbury, I believe it's called Bronze and Glow Baby for, from so long ago. Wow, it's it like actually just disappeared. It's kind of psycho with my skin tone, but it looks better in person. What it really needs is like a highlight so I don't look like um, like a bruised, bruised gal. Okay, well, let's just move on. All right, so I'm gonna tell you guys about the hot springs. I'm not gonna tell you guys which ones they were though because there wasn't that many people there and um, I don't want my enormous fan base to go overcrowd. They were mag mag magnificent. Google Maps kind of, I just put in the hot springs, not like the address of a campsite, and Google Ma Maps sent me on a, a crazy off-roading experiment, which I did in a blue Prius, which was just definitely not the, um, it's not, it's not the ideal off-roading vehicle, as you might imagine. However, the Prius killed it, um, absolutely. The Prius completely um, took, took it all like a champ. And there was like various pools of hot springs and it was right next to the river. So you could jump from the boiling hot, hot springs water into the freezing cold river water, which I only dared to do a little bit, but Liv was like addicted in a good way. Um, she kept going in and out and apparently it really made her body feel really good afterwards. Honestly, it looks fierce in that lighting, um, but let's just ruin it right now with this white. So how did it feel wearing these enorm looks, most of them more dramatic than this, in LA on a daily basis? Well, I think it was honestly a little less intimidating in LA than it was here or like for instance at a gas station on the way there just like new york it's a much more like socially performative place absolutely not all right i guess i'm gonna find a sharpener i'll be right back um did i do something i think i might have oh yeah Highlight, and then we'll know for sure. This might be something. Is it something? Well, regardless of whether or not it's something, it's definitely gonna feel pretty gnarly because <laughs> um, I'm gonna wear it on my way to the post office. So, uh, I guess that's it for this week. I hope you enjoyed and were hopefully inspired by, um, not to toot my own horn, but perhaps some kind of expressive courage to be able to wear your strange creations or, um, uh, copies of other people's creations out in your daily lives. Because wouldn't it be a beautiful beautiful life to be able to go outside looking however you want to look. Anyway, um, I'll see you next time and wish me luck on my way to the post office. Okay. Alright, here I go.